applied my foundation and did my brows ahead of time. Um, now I'm just going to move on to the eyeshadow primer and apply that generously on both of my lids. The eyeshadow primer is just going to grab onto my eyeshadow. So I'm taking this reddish brown from my custom palette and applying it above the crease with a fluffy brush. I'm also going to go on my lower lash line as well. Next, I'm going to take my white jumbo eyeliner and I usually use this as a base when I want that eyeshadow to really show. So that's what I'm doing on my lids right now. Top of that white base, I'm going to go with this light pink. I started applying it and it didn't show as well as I wanted. So I just went ahead and applied a brighter pink instead. A cut crease is a must for this look, so I'm taking this darker gray color and applying it with an angle brush between the pink and the brown. Um, I'm just going to create a line first and then blend it out. Now on my inner corners, I'm applying a shimmery white eyeshadow. This is also going to go underneath my brows. Um, I want my eyes to sparkle like the crystals in my jewelry. I still feel like I need to add some glitter to glam out my eyes a bit more because the outfit is so flashy, you just want to create a nice balance. Now the liner always pulls the whole look together, so I'm going to take my gel black liner, create a medium sized wing, and make the line thinner as it goes towards my inner corners. Last eyeshadow I'll be using is this light brown called Bohemian by Ofra Cosmetics and this is going to go right below my lower lash line. It's going to plump it out and make my eyes look bigger all together. Next step is applying black liner on my lower lash line. This is just going to give my eyes a nicer shape and then of course applying mascara to darken my lashes. Lastly for the eyes, I'm going to take my false lashes. False lashes are like my best friend because once I pop them on, it's like a whole new me. Now to highlight my cheekbones, I'm going to take this Trust Fund Beauty That Glow Though Highlighter and apply it right above. Um, I'm going to blend this afterwards and this is just going to create that subtle highlight that I need. Just underneath the highlight, I'm going to apply this Barbie Pink Blush. I'm using an angle brush for a better application. On the lips, I'm going to take a nude lip liner and use this to bring out my lip shape. Once that's done, I'm taking a Candy Pink Liquid Lipstick and applying it over. I'm still not through with the lips yet. Since I'm a big fan of lip ombres, I'm taking a brighter pink, which is similar to the sari in my background, and applying it on the center. And bam, with the blue contacts, the look turned out just how I wanted. I also had to put on the earrings now because it was just so heavy to wear it throughout the video. Alright, now that I look like a Bollywood Barbie, the only thing I need to do is turn on some Bollywood jam and start.